Anytime you're looking for a new dog, there are lots of things to consider. First and foremost, will the breed fit your lifestyle? You don't want a Pekingese if you're a trail runner. In that case, go for a German Shorthair. Similarly, if you're a couch potato, a Border Collie probably isn't the best choice for you. We understand that there are lots of factors that go into canine health, but our list is based on some of the most widely known disorders most common to the breeds on this list. Oh, these are the best dogs. Actually, those are the worst dogs. Now with that out of the way, let's get started. Here are our top five most unhealthy dog breeds. We start with one of the more easily identifiable, but lesser known breeds on our list, the Sharpe. With its characteristic skin folds and rough hair, the Sharpe is easily recognizable. A loyal family dog, the Sharpe can be a long-lived companion. However, those characteristic skin folds that make it so recognizable, they also make it very susceptible to skin diseases. If not cleaned regularly, the Sharpe's skin folds are a breeding ground for bacteria which can lead to a wide variety of dermal infections. The skin fold problems aren't limited to skin issues, however. Because there are folds on the face and around the eyes, the Sharpe often suffers from ocular issues as well, including eye infections and early development cataracts. Much like other medium to large breeds, the Sharpe can suffer from hip dysplasia. However, they are prone to gastrointestinal irritation from an overarching condition simply called Sharpe fever. When looking at the Sharpe as a potential pet, it's best to be ready for more regular cleanings than other breeds to help cut down on those skin issues. One of the tallest dogs in the canine world, the Great Dane is popular as a family companion and as a Hollywood star. These former guard dogs and hunters are frequent couch potatoes and can make excellent family companions. Oddly adaptable to a wide variety of living conditions, the Great Dane is one of the shortest living breeds, often only making it six or seven years. Much like many other giant breeds, the Great Dane is sadly prone to a wide variety of health issues that can shorten an already short lifespan. As much as their size can be endearing, it's a double-edged sword, being the cause of many of their health problems. The Great Dane sadly has a laundry list of potential health issues. They're prone to hip dysplasia, wobbler syndrome, which is a degenerative cervical spine issue, dilated cardiomyopathy, which is irregular growth of the heart, and gastric torsion, which is an intestinal disorder that causes abdominal pain and swelling. Sadly enough, these gentle giants often don't reach their full potential because of these health issues. If you're enjoying this content, be sure to like and subscribe. Also, be sure to hit the notification bell to be notified of the latest content from the most. Next on our list, the Rottweiler. Rotties, as they're commonly known, are robust working dogs that make excellent guard dogs for a variety of living conditions. Known to be loyal to their family members and even gentle playmates for children, the Rottweiler is a popular companion around the world. What may be less well known is that the popularity has come with a price. Much like other popular breeds, Rotties have become subject to poor breeding habits and are seeing much more common hereditary diseases. The most common of these is subaortic stenosis. This is a narrowing of the cardiovascular blood vessels, making the Rottweiler a potential subject to heart attacks. They're also prone to both hip and elbow dysplasia, mostly because of their bulk. Interestingly enough, even though they're frequently bred as guard dogs, Rotties can be prone to deafness, much like the Dalmatian. Another giant breed on our list, the Irish Wolfhound is one of the most uncommon breeds in the world. These lovable giants are known as calm and dignified family companions. They're excellent with children because of their laid back nature. They are truly giants, however, with males frequently weighing over 150 pounds and standing three feet tall at the shoulder. It is interesting to note, however, that even at this size, they usually don't make good guard dogs. This is due to their calm demeanor. However, just their size and shaggy appearance may be enough to scare away potential intruders. Even though they make for excellent pets, the Irish Wolfhound is prone to several health issues that put it high on our list of the most unhealthy dogs. As was the case with most every other giant breed on our list, these giants frequently suffer from hip dysplasia and swollen hearts. These issues are believed to be directly related to their size. 
One of the health issues unique to the Irish Wolfhound, however, is liver failure. Our last entry, the English Bulldog, is a repeat on our list, previously showing up on our best lazy dogs list. The English Bulldog is a popular chunky companion. This breed is easily recognizable because of its distinctive features, including its short, smushed face. In the past, this characteristic of a short muzzle, less commonly known as being brachycephalic, was less pronounced. The move to a shorter muzzle in more modern times has brought with it the characteristic of all brachycephalic breeds, significant obstruction of the upper airways. Like all the other breeds on this list, the breed specifics of the English Bulldog are the same characteristics that lead to its most common health issues. Their most common issues include dry eyes, numerous heart-related issues, deafness, hydrocephalus or excessive spinal fluid which leaks into the skull cavity, and other spinal issues. We know that you may have had some of the breeds on our list. We hope that yours had long and healthy lives. However, it's undeniable that some breeds come with certain health limitations. Let us know in the comments what your experience has been with the breeds on our list. If you're looking for more dog-related content, check out the playlist we got linked here. What video would you like to see next? Leave a comment below. We post weekly focusing on the best, the worst, and the most amazing content.